Who is Randy? Don't bring anyone love into this. Yo, mama in the fucking shit! I hate dyed hair on men. It's really weird. Like the Sharpie. Yeah. <laughs> it's so. The Seagal. <laughs> Look. He's still, he's, he's got, how old is he now? Just how old is Steven Seagal? A th- he's in his early thousands. He's got to be. And it's jet black. <laughs> Mark Harmon. He's 69, dude. Mark Harmon told me a story. I was working on NCIS. No big deal. And <laughs> Mark Harmon told me a story about Steven Seagal where he met him at like the Paramount lot. Before his first movie came out, but uh, Mark Harmon had seen the movie because the director wanted to work with Mark Harmon. It's like, here's this movie I just finished. Check it out. See if you want to work with me. Before Seagal's first movie came out? Yeah. So the okay. movie wasn't out yet, but it was like going to be Seagal's first starring thing. And so Mark Harmon sees him at Paramount, goes up and goes, hey, man, I saw your movie. You're really good. You got something there. But just one thing, don't let anyone ever film you running ever again. You have a really weird run. And Harmon goes, I go into the commissary. I eat for 20 minutes. I come back out. He's still standing there staring at me. <laughs> it's like, how fucking dare how you? Fuck it. Yeah, I mean, Steven Seagal running is like one of the best YouTube yeah. clips. It's such a... I mean, you've there's, heard... There's compilations of it. Have you heard that old Stallone story? About Seagal? Yeah, about... <laughs> okay. Here, here's, here it is. <laughs> Why are his arms doing that? You're talking about arms, highly trained arms. Why are his highly yeah. trained arms doing that? I mean, it looks like he's like, he's gonna, he's gonna cup. He looks like an inflatable car place guy. He looks what? like he he looks like he's learning how to run. I think he looks like he's. It's like that episode of Friends where Phoebe runs like that. Yeah, yeah. It's a joke run. It's, you go. This it's is a joke a, run. What, dude? Look at those little arms. Why are they flailing? What's wrong? All his power is in his legs. That's what we just learned. <laughs> Also, for somebody that like has such an ego, you would assume that he would see that and be like, "I look fucking weird running." Well, there's this the Stallone story is that he him, he goes up to Sylvester Stallone and goes, "I just read the most amazing, powerful mo- uh, Rob Schneider script." Ro- he did it to Rob Schneider too. Really? <laughs> yeah, that, Rob Schneider told that story the week that he he told that story from when he uh, seems to go hosted SNL. Oh. And is widely regarded as the worst yeah host ever. And told the story you're gonna say. So maybe he told it to both. Yeah, he goes up the most amazing, powerful, well written script I've ever read in my life. And Sly goes, Who wrote it? And he goes, I did. I did. <laughs> yeah, it's amazing. <laughs> you think he was worse than Nancy Kerrigan? I don't know. They said I read a thing that said who were like, like an asshole. They, they asked who were like they go, the the worst people we've ever had host. Like, like as a just you know, showing up, going over the the, the rough ideas, the pitches that they have. Yeah. And then throughout the week, they said, Seagal, anything that like p- poked fun at him, he was mm-hmm. like, no. Because hosts can kill sketches. And he was yeah. like, nope. I've always thought that like. I can see, tri- some- I can see Tripoli going. <laughs> <laughs> for some people, like for some successful people, learning like athletic fighting is a thing. It's like, it's either for really successful people or you're at the very bottom. You're like, well, at least I can be tough. Yeah. You're like, I can't. I have no other tangible skills, but like I will fight you. Yeah, and that th- I don't know what the, where this guy. I I mean, this shit's ridiculous. So I want to know everything. This about This bullshit him. over here, the old pig tits. What he does? <laughs> Jesus. Yeah. This shit's ridiculous. That guy just did a flip. I mean, he's doing dramatic falls. Yeah. The yeah. These guys are doing full on capoeira just to pretend Steven Seagal's kicking their ass. Yeah. This is supposed. This is Aikido. He is an Aikido master, but this sure. is this is nonsense that he's doing. My thing is like, you want to impress me, Stephen? Take off the head wrap because we know that's what you won't do. Yeah, look how tired he looks. Look at why does his goatee also, have to be that black? It's it's so it's. It looks like it was painted on with a stencil, like Shepard Fairey did his facial hair. Yeah, and are you breathing, man? <laughs> are you breathing when you do this? Why, why does it look like you're not even awake? Even there, there are some legit kids that were like, this is stupid. Is he in of Russia? Course. Yes. I mean, I told you to follow a look at this Russian, that account. Yeah, that's great. Tremendous. Great. Tremendous. And they're all applauding. Do you think, first of all, doesn't most of that audience like, are like, who's this fucking yeah, like you feel weird, it, the, yeah, the, black-haired the, fat guy? The eight, Well, I have a feeling that his movies are still big as shit in Russia. Really? Someone had to fly him over there. That's not his dime. No, of course. Like he's he, like he's like a, uh, you know, a celebrated, yeah, like member of the state now. 
Like he, I am. You know, he I has I'm privileges. S- I'm slowly getting more into how weird Russia is. Hello, and thank you for watching that highlight. Uh, if you want to see more of those, we have them. They're provided for you. So enjoy. Just do a deep dive, like you're trying to study us. Click on these and subscribe. Hit the subscribe button, and then they'll just be delivered to you. You can watch them when they come out. Please do it.